Okay, so I made a cup of coffee before I start this episode. And it tastes really, really good, man. Damn. Um, so I'm starting this right after the last episode. We uh, made it to uh, Nassau. We made friends with uh, Aduwale. We were prisoners together, I believe. Yeah. We put our crew together, bro, and everything. We lit. Get it. Okay, let me synchronize this real quick so we can reveal um, a little bit of the map. Beautiful. Fast travel unlocked to this location. Alright, so we're gonna speak to Adewale. Real quick. My god, you're a sight for salty eyes. Come you in and have a drink. Morning, all. I can't wait. Who's this? Adewale, the Jackdaw's quartermaster. Jackdaw. <gasps> you named your brig after a poxy bird. Oh, everybody got the ref Adi, reference. These lads are the better part of our growing confederacy here. Ed Thatch, Ben Hornigold, James Kidd. You let him carry a pistol, do you? Peace, Ben. Ade saved my life. And now we're looking to find a crew to fill out the rest of my ship. Well, there are scores of capable men about. We use caution. A shipload of the King's sailors showed up a fortnight back, causing trouble and knocking about like the old place. Right. I'll see who I can muster. We'll see what we can muster. Jackdaw crew. This meter indicates your crew strength. Crew is, is an essential resource that allows you to plunder ships. Bigger ships require more crew to board. I like that. There are two ways to recruit crew. You can hire people in a tavern. You can help pirates in trouble. Okay, new objective. Pirates recruited. Send any men you find to the jackdaw. I'll put them to work. Cheers, Ade. Okay, so we need to recruit ourselves some pirates. That's four right there. And, uh, synchronize real quick.
Yo, they killed him. Um, that's only one. Why did you give me two? But I'll take it. Clean and silent. Stay down. Beat these prisoners real quick. How to reload. Hello. Are they hanging someone? This pirate bears the blood of many innocent on his hands. His Majesty's honorable representative. Why isn't he hit? Did he still see me? Back to the tavern it is. Self a crew people. Now you'll want to sail somewhere rich with plunder. Have you heard of a place called the Observatory? Aye, it's an old legend, like El Dorado or the Fountain of Youth. What have you heard? It's meant to be a temple or a tomb, hiding a treasure of some kind. That's it. See here. Oh, all right. It's fairy stories you prefer a gold, is it? It's worth more than gold, Thatch. 10,000 times above what we could pull off any Spanish ship. Hmm. Robbing the king to pay his porpoise is how we earn our keep here, lad. It ain't a fortune, it's a fantasy. This arm and kill three guards, shoot the ropes to save the pirate. Did none of that. But it's okay. We made it though. Okay. 
okay, okay. This game is full of chests, bro. Love it. Prizes and plunder. Star mission, yeah. Morning, Kenway. Morning. Not a bad looking tinder box you got there. You sound a bit green, horny gold. Is it envy? Because mine's bigger than yours. <laughs> no, I reckon it's this Jamaican funk. <laughs> Bro, I read I prefer that. Prefer the Spanish stuff. <laughs> So, you've got yourself a fancy brig now. Fine. Well, I'm gonna teach you how to say it all right. And how to take a prize the proper way. Thatch, we'll catch you up at the old fishing village. Aye. 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 So, that was... Where's your helmsman, Kenway? I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? I've no need for schooling. How many prizes did we take together as privateers? There's a prize worth taking. Good. Take us in close. After you subdue a prize, project authority. Demand respect that you would never give yourself. This weaves a spell over soft minds. For your victims must always have in the back of their minds the uneasy idea that you could snap at any moment and unseen them from prick to stern. Incapitate a spoon. I'm good. Fire what cannons you will, and land a few strikes if you must, but for God's sake don't sink Wait, what? It's no fun fishing cargo out of the sea, although it can be done. When a ship is on fire, it means it's incapitated. You can either get close and press B to board it, which I got all this cargo, do to sink it and get half its cargo. Okay, let me board. We've been hit! She's disabled now and taking on a decent amount of water. So keep your cannons quiet. Take care not to sink her. Lay up alongside her. Let's board it. Oh, he disabled me. Yeah, baby. It's mine now. Que tengo un buen día, señor. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you owe. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, señor. Tengo familia. Hmm. Anyone speak English? English? L little bit. Tell your friends we're stealing your goods, and we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbox. You got that? Please do repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lock them in the hole mm -hmm. and take everything that isn't nailed down. <laughs> What should we do with this ship? Repair jackdaw. 
Um, that's the only option. We've got 35 wood. Hold tight, here they come! Pain's out, let's go! Ship coming off the It's a shaky fire. feeling sailing about with this stolen cargo. He's weak, he's right there, come on! I should do it. We got rum, sugar, fire barrels, repair jack doll. We got it all, baby. Good take today, can we? Half a dozen scores of that size, and you'll be set for a year. Now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jack doll with a few more trinkets. Oh, in the slow mo. It, it didn't even hit. Ready to we point. came to Nassau to get away from the likes of kings. Well, I'll be a man of poverty and promise anyway. Jesus, let that dream go. Bro, they're hitting us. How are they hitting us? The place to be. Not England. Do you ever dream of a big Can't even reach him. A ship so full of gold and silver. Just split it and sail home. Sure. Every man wants to find a dozen chests of gold with no owners. They're as rare as an honest king. All sails! He'll take it! Top sails, gallants! Loose and trim! Bro, this looks insane. Thunder foe. Close up! Beat her steps! Come off the wind, Our my boys! straight for you, so Let's move! Okay, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a parallel park this real quick. Sounds all but me! See, bro, parallel parking at its finest. So I tried to use this thing last time; it didn't work. I don't know why. Let's try it this time. There we go. The water looks fantastic, bro. I like how much work to put into the water, bro. I mean, it is a pirate game. Buy intermediate hull. I don't know what you said, bro. But I like it. The Jack Daw upgrades. Hull armor. Cost 1,000 reals. Um. Okay. Oh. The Jack Daw has been repaired and upgraded. I like it, I like it. 
Bro, look how big the sale is. Can I buy more upgrades? Got some cash I want to burn. 100%. Not a bad take today. Keep this up and Nassau will be the first city where men and women may live as God may. Easy and free. All it takes is a few drops of blood, sweat, and a swatch of cloth. We fly no colors out here. Praise the lack of them. So let the black flag signal nothing but your allegiance to man's natural freedoms. Black flag, baby. This one's yours. Fly proud. I will. I hand over the docket, I lend you. If we're to keep our republic afloat, we'll need guns as well as gold. That means attacking the navy. So long as they're flying King Philip's colors will not offend our own monarch. King Philip. Interesting. As you've likely seen, the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Hi, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. So Gather to metal. The Navy out of hiding, it's best to cause a bit of mischief. Catch a few small fish to attract the big ones. That's right. So plunder and pillage as you see fit, Captain Kenway. Spyglass. The spyglass is your best tool at sea. Look at a ship to see how powerful it is in what cargo it is carried. Look at a location to see everything available there. Hold RB to use it. Use R. Look around and L to zoom. Alright. Look at a location to see everything. Okay. Sail ho! Military class brig on the horizon! Good eye, man. Level 17 this, has Kenway? metal and rum. She won't go down without an honest fight. Who's up to take it out? Oh, look at that pass? ram at this. Some guy. Ah! That's a sound I like to hear. Pipe to corners. What a nice ram. Get him. They're gonna ram us! No! Oh, we're destroying him. Stay where you are. Let's board that one. Got male rum heavy shot. Ooh. The main reason I boarded the ships is so I can repair the jackdaw. So we need five more medals. Someone to kill. Fire! 
Charlie Brown boys. Gotcha. Let me use my handy dandy gun. Cheats. Cheats allow you to replay missions with interesting modifiers. Keep in mind that progression saving is turned off. To activate a sheet, open the pause menu, you go into Absurdo. And why? We good here. Got rum, sugar, heavy shots, baby, we set. Wait, that had no metal. Oh. Okay. Civilian. Civilian. Where am I to go? with him. I got how many on us? I was in pants. What the? I almost died there. Not 
We lost two crew members. What? Precious loot. Precious loot. Now, for the other ships, I don't know if I should just destroy them or board them as well. That was a rumble by God. How do we fare? A fine purchase, no mistake. Now, I think it's time to lay low and drive our way back into secrecy. Agreed. So, how do we get rid of this notoriety you stirred up? Get rid of the notoriety. That was easy. Purchase, no mistake. Now I think it's time to lay low and drive our way back into secrecy. Easy work, easy work, easy sweep, baby. Pirating is hard, bro. Being a pirate is hard. If you ever considered, you know, picking that up as a profession. I'm telling you firsthand, it's hard. Oh my God. How do we fare? A fine purchase, no mistake. Now I think it's time to lay low and drive our way back into secrecy. Agreed. So how do we get rid of this notoriety Ooh. you've stirred up? Money, my boy. Is that a bounty well, hunter? Well, bribe to the right government official. You'll see the military off your tail. Right, let's do that. Smart thinking. We're ready, sir. Oh no, we hit the edge. So if you ever think about tracking me down again, that's what you get. I would say the danger has passed. Alright, we docking in, baby. Talk to the local officer. Alright. So what is the officer? Dude. Ahoy, Captain. Need to go underground? Right. Oh. Now let me work my magic. Notoriety. 
buy board side cannons. Ooh. Enter. So what is this exactly? Is this our uh, change equipment over here? Okay, I guess. I guess see, this is where you outfit ship. Buy Jackdaw upgrades. Ports. Yep, that's what we want. Seventy. Is that metal? That looks like. Uh, I don't know, man. We got it, so. Wow. Imagine having all these up. Oh. It'll take a while to level this up, baby. Look how many upgrades this one got. Like it, we looking good. Ooh, bit by bit, our ship is getting jagged up. You're a wonder, can we? You've a knack for this kind of work. It ain't work if you love it. Ah. <laughs> I like that. Oh. It ain't work if you love it. But I ain't doing this forever, lads. Only until I get enough coin to buy some land and influence back home. Jesus, will you listen to your trite? Still dreaming all about that strumpet back in England when you could have any better you wanted here and now. Ah, such Love, lofty bro. goals for you gents. And here I thought I was in the company of scoundrels. Fine purchase today. Indeed. What's the crew's mood? All smiles and no teeth. And there's a few talking about meeting with Master Kid to steal from a nearby plantation. Plantation? Ambitious, profitable too, if we can manage it. Aye, it's a good idea. Plunder ship, plunder thirty sugar. Sugar cane and it yields. Okay. Loose and trim too. Every last scrap of duck on the wind. Let's beat it. Let's hit the winds and waves, boys. The soothing mm, view. I think we've lost. Love it. Bro, these songs they sing, it's actually pretty nice. Well, that was unintended. We made it ashore, boys. Yeah. Bro, I'm loving this game so far. I, I played it before. But this is one of the Assassin's Creed games I only played once. Every other game I played more than like five, six times. Especially two. I played like 17 times. Shitter Kane and Seals. Why, look. It's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy, and yet. <laughs> Ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, Kenway. Still looking sleek and mean. 
Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Talking shite. <laughs> so, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his Keep plantation, talking. I'll point him out. I would. Is it a Mr. Backford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. Dozens. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your prime. Okay, so I guess we're gonna be following this fella. See where he leads us, man. Despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment. Nope, nope. Is there a manual button for to put a hood on? Burford, Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It was a good harvest this year. You might not talk so loud, sir. This isn't anything like a friendly port, Ken. No, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you say, the whole of us are So I think we gotta reach the jackdaw in this time. That's why they gave us this time, of course. So we can follow them before they take off. No, they're leaving. Captain. You have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. The look I've seen before. You mark well, Ade. I've just overheard one of the Bagford's men talking grandly about his plantation. Oh, that's a big ship. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. That is a big ship, yo. That's a man of war, is it? Restricted areas are areas you're not supposed to. Oh, really? Yeah. Ships will instantly attack you and attack you if you enter these field of view. Uh, ships fields of view are displayed on the minimap. Avoid them to not get in conflict. These are represented in red on the minimap. Okay, figure as much. Hold out. I see them. Level 36. Oh, we can we can one shot that. Damn, this game has a lot of ship traveling. man's working for Peter Backford's people. Do you know them? The Backfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Backfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. 
But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled, or something else? Cane juices. The hard process making sugar. Dangerous. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, which run between two metal rollers, across the juice from the fire. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the waters from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. Let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. There's a touch on the skin, you stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. Okay. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackpot. Okay, we made it. Okay, so sabotage alarm bells. Or oh, that's optional. Gotta tell me, bro. Spit out the info. What's happened here? Why such disarray? What if it do, sir? That's all. It's Wellington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. It's no bother, sir. We have everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? What are for? I believe I was following you. By pilots, if my eyes on me, though the ship was uncommonly large in some vessels. Certainly wasn't slavers, though, not a ship that size. In any case, hmm. double the watch and keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. His job interrupted? What do you mean? They went separate ways. You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Hmm. For God's sake, what the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? <laughs> Forgive me, sir. I am... He's swinging around. If I see any strangeness about, you'll hear the bell ringing straight away, I promise. Oh, no, you won't. There is no alarm. Queen. Shop, I want to talk to you. Queen. Queen. 
So this is how we get more loot. They're teaching us how to get more loot. Okay, I like it. So this episode is all about how to get loot, how to upgrade, which is this game about. I love it. I wish. Yeah. I don't know, man. We got 100% synchronized on that, which is sweet. Sweet. Man, this game has a lot of water traveling in it. I love it. But in editing, it's pain, bro. Alright, man. I think I'm going to end this episode here today, guys. It's been a blast. Um, so make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, comment, um, help me out a lot. Uh, make sure man, you tune in for more episodes, bro. And uh, peace out, man.